I know. Let's try a look of far off wonderment. Okay, we'll, we'll gaze into our future and we'll think about our marriage and the days to come. Okay. <laughs> Chandler, what is the matter with your face? Wait, this picture is supposed to say Geller and being to be married, not local woman saves drowning moron. <laughs> hey, don't laugh at him. He's my drowning moron. Aww. That's it, that's it, take it, take it. I like this one. It seems to say, I love you, and that's why I have to kill you. It can't all be bad. Find the one where you make your bedroom eyes. Oh, there it is. Oh my God, those are my bedroom eyes? <laughs> Why did you ever sleep with me? Do you really want to pull at that thread? We're having a really good time. Me too. Sorry that guy in the subway licked your neck. Oh. No, that's okay. He's a friend. Hey, uh, I don't mean to be presumptuous, but I have these two tickets to the ballroom dancing finals tomorrow night if you want to go. Yeah, I... Well, you know, I, I mean, I missed the, the semifinals, so I think I would just be lost. <laughs> Look, I know that it's really lame, but I got these tickets for my boss, and... Oh, no, 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 my God. Okay, don't freak out. I'll go. No, it's... <laughs> my ex-wife, Whitney, is out there. I cannot deal with her right now. That woman is crazy. Okay, I know. Hold on. Hey, Ross. Yeah? Yeah. Um, that's Whitney, Kyle's ex-wife out there. Now, do you think you could, you know divert her so we could slip out? What? No. <laughs> well, okay, but I have two tickets to the ballroom dance finals. Look, I don't think so, Phoebes. Uh... <sighs> All right, I'll do it. But just because you're a friend. Ginger. All right, I want my key back. I don't have it. It's right there. Ugh, okay, Sherlock. Uh, I'm sorry, but you, you better go, Phoebes. All right, well, I just wanted to say thank you, though, for diverting Kyle's ex. Oh, yeah, I know. You're welcome. Yeah. We'll, uh, we'll talk about it later. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Whitney. Hi, Ross. Are you ready for breakfast? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Ex-wife, you were supposed to divert her, not date her. Hi, I'm sorry. Can you give me a second while I talk to this woman, uh, who, by the way, did not spend the night? Sure. Okay. <laughs> I did divert her, and we ended up having a great time, okay? Watching ballroom dancing? Yes, that's where we realize we are both super cool people. <laughs> well, look, okay, Ross. Kyle just told me some really bad stuff about her. Like, like what? Like, she's really mean, and she's overly critical, and, and, no, she will paint a room a really bright color without even checking with you. Okay. And she uses sex as a weapon. Fine, thank you for warning me. At breakfast, I'll be on full alert for room painting and sex weapons. You're still gonna go out with her? Yeah. Well, didn't you hear what I just said? Phoebes, come on. I mean, consider the source. Of course her ex-husband's gonna say that stuff. Now, if you'll excuse no, me... No, listen to me! She is crazy! Uh, your door isn't soundproof. You see? Nothing is good enough for her. <laughs> <laughs> 